All right, here we are, Eden Prime, guys. It's been a while since I've been here. Look at that wonderful sun. I also want to say Merry Bladed Christmas to you guys. Hope we all had a wonderful holiday. Hope you got some nice gifts. It's good to be playing this game. I gotta get used to the controls. Okay, so you gotta hold down A to run. About to get our first bit of action here in a minute. Okay, that's how you pull out the pistol. How do you swap? Okay. That's how you use your team abilities. I've never really want to use them too much, not including my own, to be honest. But I might start using them a lot more throughout the series because it's just a tactical thing. And you guys know I'm a fully automatic son of a bitch, so I love using my weapons. And I forget what the hell that is. You know what? Now's my chance. Uh, Caden, I want you to use throw on that. As you epically miss. Okay, I guess it's whatever then. I know I remember my first time playing through this game it was kind of slow. I guess it's because I was in the preview program and like they were just working out the kinks and also I didn't realize that you can affect even back on like a first generation Xbox game, you can affect like the way the graphics are. Like you can change the motion blur, you can change the way that like there's grain, there's film grain. Yeah, there was a lot of that stuff, guys. It's kind of annoying. But I figured out how to turn it off. Okay, and I'm trying to remember how do you pull put away your weapon? Okay, it's hold down B, and it's X to pull it out. Alright, we're figuring shit out. Now let's just, uh, let's get moving. I don't know when I'm gonna break this video off, guys. It could be long, it could be short. Don't know yet. Just bear with me on that. And that man just got lit the fuck up. Alright, how do you take cover? Okay, there we go. There we go. Alright, so we got some drones. I'm guessing we can use sabotage on that drone right over there. And once again, I am a soldier, so I don't do anything like that. I think... I don't even remember what sabotage is really for. I think it has to do... I know, like, using your teammates' ability, especially since I'm a soldier, means I lack biotic power. I use just brute force to tear through people's armor. Having your teammates is really good. So having a good, like, all-around squad is the best thing you can do. Rip right through his shields. You're at a chance. Sometimes Marines die. The rest of us just have to carry on. We still have to find that beacon. Aye, aye, sir. Wonder whatever happens to never leave a soldier behind. I think that's just too many years in the past, honestly, in this game. <laughs> Just thinking about that for a minute. Do I even have to destroy these here? You know what? Just gonna make short work of them. So all my weapons carried over. If I had the option, guys, I probably wouldn't have brought that just because I wanted to be fresh. But I mean, I can't really help it with the new game plus. And I didn't really feel like starting a new character because I really just wanted to. I wanted this character to be the namesake of the series on this channel. And Caden is down. I repeat, Caden is down for the count. Oh, no, he's not. He just lost shields and health. Okay. Fortunately, my weapons are powerful, so... I don't know if this means I'm going to be able to exactly storm rule everybody in this game, but we'll see. And as you notice, this game does not have ammo. We have, like, just overheating weapons. Upgrade, kick, connect, buffer... I don't really know how to use a lot of this, so hopefully this game will give me a quick, like, crash course on how to, so I can remember. There's, like, a certain point in the game where you're not really going to find anything. That's the funny part. Like, you won't find anything as far as new armor goes or anything like that, so hopefully we find something. And I also want to mention, too, guys, I am on break currently from school, so got this entire week to make a lot of good videos, quality content for you guys, so please subscribe if you haven't already, as I said before. And let me know if you guys have watched the Assassin's Creed movie yet. I'm going to go watch that. I've heard some pretty gnarly things, but then again, some positive things as far as gamers go. Gamer reviews say that if you're a gaming fan, it's the best gaming adaptation by far. Because it's so true, but that doesn't translate well into a movie for modern, like, moviegoers. So, I don't know yet. I'll have to go watch that and give you guys one of my quality reviews. And I am out of shields. Take cover.
And there goes Ashley, our very first squad mate. And she too is a soldier, just like I am. Al Shepard. Well, that was simple as hell. Holy shit, I forgot how easy that would be. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Give me a status report, Williams. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. This isn't your fault, Williams. You couldn't have done anything to save them. Yes, sir. We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Move out. And that is what we shall do, is exact some payback. I gotta say, my guy is looking type stylish with that assault rifle right now, though. We got some cry rounds, some tungsten rounds. Got a crate, a scorpion light armor human. I have to take a look at some of this stuff eventually. Oh wait, currently have 135, the limit is 150. So yeah, pretty soon, I believe you can destroy or like deteriorate a lot of items down to just meta gel. Or not meta gel, but like a certain material that you can use. So that's something I will be doing. I'm not really a fan of helmets in this game. I'm not even gonna lie to you, but I don't know. It's like after a while to grow on you. Oh. Okay. Um. I'm gonna have my boy Caden over here. Use throwing that guy real fast. There you go. Take him out. So yeah, I look forward to getting more squad mates with uh, different abilities. Be able to use that to my advantage all day. Okay. What does Ashley have? Oh, wait, she's not even a part of the squad technically yet, so I can't even really use her. And it's your job to arm your teammates in the future, too, by the way. Something I'm going to have to do. I'm going to do a lot of things that I never really cared to do in the first one, just because I want to demonstrate this as a proper type walkthrough, as I've always done in the past. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the gas? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Alright, so we gotta go up. There's a crate right over here. Let's we'll see what we got in here. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check got a it couple out. items, nothing too serious. We're gonna go meet up with Nihilus real quick. You know, I still remember that. That's funny. We got specters in this game. If you guys remember my year one video, I used that song, Spectre. Hold up. Keep your guard up. Oh, God. They're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? Does not matter. I'm going to shoot first, ask questions later. Okay, now we can use her. Um. So Caden, yeah, he's untrained and everything because I believe he's an adept, which means he uses raw biotic power to kill everybody. So that means I can't really use anything but his abilities, which I have to upgrade to get more of. And she's a soldier, so she could generally use anything. I'm going to use a shotgun because I believe these guys like to run up close and personal, the husk. But it's not a good idea to let them get close. And you know what? For that sake, I'm going to use... I have unity is what you use to revive your teammates. This is a shield boost. Immediately, so you, I think like it's a shield boost, and then we're gonna use adrenaline burst just for that extra damage. I'm not fucking with you right now. Get away from me. Yeah, the shock. No, I take that back. The cyber rifle is like the first thing to overload. Oh snap! I thought he was one of them. But yeah, as I was saying, I use that song Specter, and I got a copyright claimed. But you know what? It's all good. I think I'm gonna upload that video to Twitter. To be honest with you guys, so it's there because I put too much work and too much time into it for it to not be seen. And speaking of too much work and too much time, hopefully you guys actually like that brand new intro, new and improved intro I got on the channel, featured at the beginning of every series, and my brand new logo. Okay, I have 138. I gotta look into my items in a minute. All right, I'm gonna do it after we finish checking this area out. 
Can we get another crate? Shit, we got 142 now. Omni gel. I think that's what it's called. Omni gel is with your items after you've broken them down become. Okay, now these encryptions could be kind of. They could be kind of. I remember the first time when I first started playing this game, I, I couldn't do it. It's too hard. Humans, thank the maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you. I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well-preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awakened the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. That man over here looking type crazy. I don't know. I feel like I should shoot his ass. Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him. The prophet. Leader of the enemy. He was here before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since and the That attack. is the clue right there, guys, that there's another Turian running around. What else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment. The next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move, until you came along. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. Alright, does anyone get like a Nolan Strauss vibe off of him? See, I believe this would be a renegade type choice if you decided to shoot him. Normally this game throughout the entire trilogy, I believe, the way they set up is like, at certain points of this wheel of dialogue, of choices you can choose, I like certain things to do Paragon choices and Renegade choices. Renegade is obviously the bad, Paragon's the good. Normally, I think Renegade's like, I wanna see if I remember correctly, it's like either up here or down here. Like, that's clearly a Renegade choice to kill him, but we're not gonna do that. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Yep, see, Paragon plus two. You always make the good choices. It pays off. It's like one of those things. You gotta do... Like, you can mix it up. I think I've only ever made, like, one Renegade, renegade choice. Sarah. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. My man Nihilus just got annihilated. He dropped his guard. That's a no-no. Okay, so we are gonna pull out the gate right now. The sniper rifle just... Oh, damn. Oh, damn. 
I was about to snipe some dudes, but I don't know anymore. Yeah, so the sniper rifle is like the number one thing to heat up the fastest. I'm gonna try and use my teammates to my advantage if I can. Like, I'm gonna have Caden throw a throw on that guy. And I'm actually gonna swap to the sniper rifle now. Getting a little bit too close to comfort. The burst fire is the way to go, man. Oh shit, he got up close on me. Oh hell no, hell no, hell no, hell no. Um, shit. I did not even mean to use that. Let's go to the shotgun. Shotgun. Shotgun rain. And I'm gonna use Unity to lift up everybody that's down. And I'm gonna also heal us up real fast. Okay, there we go. I'm like the mother of the squad. I gotta care for everybody. I gotta care for myself. It's insane. Got another crate, got some Omni Gel, and if you can't open these yet, you can just use Omni Gel to open it, which, I mean, if you got it to spare, it's whatever, but at the beginning of the game, you really don't want to have to. Okay, so far, so good. Stay calm out there. We're coming out, we're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. I knew it was trouble the second I saw it, so we made a break for the sheds. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that! We survived! If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance! Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise! It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only, it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. You have something to tell me, Cole? Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You're breaking the law, Cole. We're not hurting anybody. Hell, most of the time I don't even know what's in the packages. I just thought there might be something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure there's nothing else in here that could help us out? Yeah, there's one more thing. I was gonna sell it after this was over, but you probably deserve it more than I do. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. He might have something to do with this whole attack, Cole. We need his name. It's important. Yeah, okay, you're right. His name's Powell. Works the docks at the spaceport if he's still alive. I have to go. Good luck. Ooh, score one for me. You have 143, okay. Score one for me though, man. I don't even like remember ever doing that. Alright, electronic skill too low. Yeah, we gotta increase that. Is there I gotta start like looking into that right now. Look into equipment, because I have a lot of items, so a lot of this stuff is gonna have to be Turn into Omni Gel. Yes, I have 144. Yada yada yada. Okay, so. Oh, this is the Tsunami. Okay, so I currently have the Raptor. The Tsunami has that, but the accuracy is shit. But that's something I believe we can upgrade. So we're gonna trade that over. Okay, okay. Uh, let's see what else we got as far as weaponry go. Oh, we can also equip some items for it. The comrades. So you know what? Yeah. I'll give her this. That's a good switch up. Let me go over to Caden. You know, Caden can't use none of this shit because he's untrained. So, really, pistols is the only way to go for Caden. 
I have a lot of items and a lot of doubles, so I'm gonna have to start deleting some of this shit. Okay, um. Trying to remember, how do you swap over? Okay, there we go, yeah. Because I want to see more as far as shotguns. Okay, for shotguns, this is the same gun, so yeah, we don't need that. I'm gonna start, yeah, we're gonna start breaking some of this shit down. Convert this stuff into Omni Gel. Convert that. Right that. Okay, let's see what we got for pistols. This is one of the ones that we just found, but it's got only 19 shots, and the accuracy is a little bit more poor, but it does more damage. But you know what? Well, we'll put that, and we can transfer all the upgrades from the previous one. Not that I remember even getting any upgrades for it, but they'll all go over. Okay, this is just a double. Fortunately, because Ashley is a soldier, some of this stuff can be used by her. Grenades, this is just some armor. A lot of armor I can't use because you have to be like a certain person. And this is that. Something tells me I'll get at least one good bit of armor. At least one throughout this entire playthrough. I feel like I'll get one. Okay, but yeah, as far as this goes, we're gonna start turning a lot of this shit into Omni Joe because I don't want to get like shut down when I want to pick something up that's good. So we'll get rid of a lot of this base stuff. Get up on our Omni Joe. I got 474, man. Look at all those freaking triplets I have, dude. No! God damn it, I accidentally just equipped that. There we go, I want that back. Okay, I think that, that should be good for right now. I'm not gonna really stress too much. But yeah, man, this is so far, awesome. Mass Effect 2, I feel like, was the one that a lot of people had, like, the best reception for Mass Effect 3 was okay. The ending is what I feel like just killed it for a lot of people, but I mean, eh. Commander, it's Nihilus. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait, don't, don't shoot. I'm one of you. I'm human. Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I am sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Ah, oh, Powell, this guy. What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. Okay, I have a couple ways to go about this. I can either just keep on going with the regular conversation or diverge over to the coal thing, which is what I'm going to do. Because I don't know if this is still going to be an option. I'll get it out the way now. Your call's contact here on the docks for the smuggling ring. What? No! I mean, what does it matter now? So I'm a smuggler. Who cares? My supervisor's dead. The entire crew's dead. It doesn't matter now, does it? Anything hidden nearby that we could use against the Geth? A shipment of grenades came through last week. Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military orders. You greedy son of a bitch. We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass, and all you can think about is how you can rip us off? I never thought you'd actually need those grenades. Who'd want to attack Eden Prime? We're just a bunch of farmers. How was I supposed to know? Hmm. I don't know how I feel about this, guys. Let it go, or hand them over. I mean... Fuck. <laughs> I've never really had to be put in a spot like this, really, in games too often. Um, Do I want them? Because I don't use grenades like that to be going, so I'll let them go. Forget about him. He's not worth it. You're lucky the commander's here, pal. Hand over those grenades. Oh, shit. It didn't yours. even matter. Take them. My smuggling days are over, I swear. A lot of Marines died here, Powell. Those grenades could have come in handy. If I were you, I'd think of some way to make it up to them. Yeah, uh, okay. 
There is something else I was saving. Could be worth a fortune. Experimental technology, top of the line. Take it. I don't need it. I didn't want anyone to get hurt. Really, I'm sorry. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. High explosive grenade. Ooh, I'm gonna have to take a look at that real quick, man. Another score. Score two for Cryptic. Boy, let's get it. Team Cryptic. Let's go. All right, so grenades. Yeah, I think it's just we can upgrade it, yeah, to the one that he has. Yes, we're gonna do that. I don't even remember how to throw grenades, to be honest. I'm gonna have to look that up. Ooh, that groovy-ass music, though. Wait, there was an upgrade kit over here. There it is. Tungsten rounds. Okay, we'll take them. Yeah, we're going to be converting a lot more stuff into Omni Gel pretty soon because we're already at 136. Not that I really got rid of much, and we were about to get shot at. So I'm going to use Overkill. That's the one for extra damage. I'm going to have... Oh, wait. Caden's dead. Shit. Um, Unity. Use Unity. Open fire. Because I was going to have him use Sabotage, but that didn't really happen, so... For the sake of it, I'm going to have him use, real quick, throw, take that guy down, then we blast, the fuck, that guy fell, oh, he fell overboard, 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 <laughs> excuse me, I didn't realize that, so yep, we got to upgrade the, the accuracy isn't too noticeably different from the original assault rifle, but I think I could pretty much just give that other one if I wanted to, to like another soldier down the line. Yo, Ashley felt some type of way, though. Can't say that I blame her, though. Okay, I'm gonna use my sniper rifle. I believe these guys can be a bit of a pain in the ass. I'm over here trying to, like, hold down on my left stick to, like, hold my breath. I'm playing so much COD lately. Come on, come on, come on. Bang. Oh damn! Okay, okay, we're gonna move up a little bit, guys. Take out those hostiles. Yeah, what do you think I'm doing, man? All right, um, I'm trying to think about how do I want to go about this. Luckily, this shit's so powerful; it's literally one shot, one kill, which is what I like. One more, one more. Can we get it? Let's get it. Got more meta gel. And I think that's all of them. And I'm going to equip my assault rifle back just as hell of it. I don't think you can map squad abilities in this game, unfortunately. But, well, this has been dragged on for a bit of a minute. So, that's all for now, guys. When we come back, we're going to be going to the beacon and or approaching Saren, if I remember correctly. So please drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next video of Mass Effect. Take it easy.